or leaves them. Yep, opening kickoff. And this is just the way you like to get things started. Just make sure you get your camera pointed in the right direction. Ricky Adams takes it for the Panthers. Finds a little daylight. See ya. Steve Spurrier always says the team that scores off the opening kickoff, though, sometimes struggles later in the game, and that's what happens for Batesburg Leesville in the first half. Their only points of the first half coming here. Gilbert comes all the way back, takes a 9-7 lead at half. This touchdown from Connor Owens to Taylor Leapart, but it's all Batesburg Leesville in the second half. Panthers going to win it. 30-9. Panthers four straight after losing their first two Tim Good Stuff Memorial Stadium. Now AC Flora to try to make their best start since 1974. Also trying to keep Brooklyn Casey winless. AC Flora exploding for 21 points in the second quarter. Yeah, not slowing down in the third either. Edward Kirkland taking a shovel pass, squirting through the defense there for the score. AC Flora rolling, but Brooklyn Casey responds. Jonathan Rump, he's a big athlete at quarterback. He can avoid a sack, and he can also throw the ball down the field. Yeah, he finds B.J. DeWalt, makes the catch. You know, oh. Rump, Rump has just needed some help this year. He's a really fun talent. Gets a little help from DeWalt there, and that puts him in for the touchdown. The ensuing kickoff, though, Flora's Travis Watson takes it, and he knows what to do with it. How about another kickoff return for a touchdown in the program? Flora stays undefeated. BC stays winless. The Falcons go on to take it 48-17.